I think it's really important to know what you do well and to know what works and to codify that and to repeat that, and that's important. But I think it's equally important to create an environment where innovation um, is encouraged and that failure is an option. Um, and that's really challenging in, in the nonprofit field because, quite frankly, resources are so restricted that um, that from a on the business side of the art, um, there is a very low tolerance for risk and a very low tolerance for failure. Um, and so I'm I'm intrigued at the idea of creating a, a culture of innovation on both sides of the footlights. And how we can do that is by creating a, a, a dedicated funding source that allows um, uh, innovative ideas to be tested. I'm very, I'm, I'm, I think about it much uh, as the tech industry thinks about innovation, is sort of how do we uh, identify potentially game-changing innovations that can fail fast, that we can test, that can fail fast, we can learn from that and move forward. Um, I think we don't do enough of that in the arts, and I think that it's the only way forward. I th the definition of insanity is repeating the same behavior over and over again and expecting a different result. And I think um, we've been playing it safe for a, a bit too long. And, and so that's, you know, as a leader, that's something that's very important to me and something that I'm trying to drive, drive home to the teams that I've worked with in other companies and certainly at National Ballet.